In this video I'll show you how to create satin slip knickers. For this project we will need silk satin, cotton jersey, elastic threads and pattern. The pattern consists of the back, front, band, gusset and gusset lining. The PDF pattern is available to download in six sizes. Check the link in the description below. If you choose the right size, please make sure to measure your hip circumference. It's very important. In my case, it's 94 centimeters. Thus, I get size M. I cut small clips into the pattern notches to make it easier to mark them on the fabric itself. I do that to all the pattern pieces, including gussets. Fold the fabric and place the pattern on top. I trimmed the center front seam allowance from the front and placed it on the fold. You can do the same if you want the front panel to be seamless. Then I cut pattern pieces and pin both gussets on a single layer satin and single layer jersey and cut them as well. Once all the pattern pieces are cut, I make small snips into the fabric to make the notches. I do that all pattern pieces, including gussets. Make sure to test stitch quality before you start sewing the garment. Pin the two back pattern pieces together along the center back. Stitch 5mm from the raw edge. Trim the seam allowance to 2 to 3 mm and press the seam. Turn the panels right side to right side and pin together. Stitch the joint edge using 5mm seam allowance. Press the seam flat on one side. Repeat the same steps to the center front if you cut two front panels. Align the gusset to knicker back right sides together matching centers and ends. Pin along the edge. Place the gusset lining right side down on the wrong side of the knicker back. Pin all the three layers of fabric together. Align the gusset to knicker front, right sides together, matching centers and ends. Pin along the edge. I roll the front and back panels. After that, I bring the gusset lining under and around the knickers and pin to the wrong side of the knicker back. Stitch the seam through all the layers of fabric using 10 mm seam allowance. Pull out knickers front and back, turning the gusset lining right side out. Trim excess fabric on both the gusset and gusset lining. We don't need these little triangles. Turn 7 mm seam allowance to the wrong side of the fabric and pin along the edge. Stitch 1 mm away from the fold. Press the seam. Trim the seam allowance to 2 mm. Turn the hem edge to the wrong side and closing the raw edge. Stitch an even distance from the edge.
Snatch the notches at the side seams of the knickers, pin and tuck. Align the short ends of the band right sides together and pin. Stitch using 10 mm seam allowance and press the stitch flat. Place the band right side down on the wrong side of the knickers matching the raw edges. Match the notches at the side seams, center front and center back. Pin along the edge. Stitch 10 mm seam allowance and press seam allowance towards the knickers. Turn 10 mm seam allowance to the wrong side of the band and press. Fold the band around the edge of the garment overlapping the stitch by 1 mm. Pin to the waistline of the garment. Add stitch on the band from the right side, leaving 2 cm opening at the center back for the elastic. Use a safety pin to pull elastic through the band. After that, secure the edge of the elastic by stitching its ends together. Stitch the opening from the right side and the knickers are ready. If you need pattern making services for your brand, send me a message and I'll get back to you. Until then, see you next time.